Hi, I'm Congresswoman Kendra Horn from Oklahoma's 5th District. And whether it's enjoying the Oklahoma City Philharmonic at the Civic Center or a concert at the Jones Assembly, Oklahomans love a good show. Unfortunately, the venues that put on these performances are in serious danger of permanently closing due to COVID-19. That's why I'm a proud supporter of the Save Our Stages effort and ask that you join me in this important fight. Thank you. There are a number of small businesses that may never fully recover unless we take action and provide the necessary federal assistance. Independent uh, music venues are among the hardest hit. Those businesses were frankly among the first to close their doors and may be the last to reopen them. That's why I support providing assistance for those shuttered businesses. And I will work, work with my colleagues in Congress to keep independent venues nationwide from permanently closing their doors. Recently, I've talked to so many independent music and theater venues and the artists and workers who make events like SOS Fest possible, and they all need our help. I'm fighting so hard for the Bipartisan Save Our Stages Act to provide $10 billion to help live venues stay afloat. And we know one day they'll come back bigger and stronger than ever. And so we need everyone, everyone to contact their senators and representatives and make it clear why the Save Our Stages Act is so critical. Hi, I'm Congresswoman Elise Stefanik, and I am proud to co-sponsor the Bipartisan Save Our Stages Act. This important legislation provides direct federal support for our stages and arts venues and music venues across the country. We know these arts organizations are incredibly important to our local economies and really mainstays of our main streets, whether it's in upstate New York or across America. I will always stand up for the arts as well as the important jobs related to the Arts. Thank you so much for your advocacy.